Hello everyone. I know that you've not seen me in a long, long time. In fact, the other day I was 60 and I've definitely gone grey, but that's how long it's been since you saw me last. Uh, welcome to my new study. And again, just to, uh, this isn't quite as much as a shrine as the other one was, but I'll go through some of these posters in a second. Um, but this, I've been in this room since December, so you haven't seen this yet. Um, I'll, this this uh, clip's just going to be about the tour that's going on at the moment. I'm actually going to Cliffs Pavilion tomorrow night, so obviously I will bring you some uploads over the next few weeks and months. Um, also, I just want to say um, I have launched another um, YouTube channel called The Original Soul Boy uh, 1980s. I think you have to find me there, I think, 1980s. Um, now, what I've started posting on there is different stuff. Now, one of the things is I went on a Spitfire the other day, uh, and that's me in the back there. Uh, and you'll actually see some of the clips of the Spitfire on here, actually. Um, I did two loop, one loop the loop, two vict uh, victory rolls, and yeah, I think uh, that yeah, they come up there. So that, that, that is worth just going into and seeing because it was absolutely amazing. Now, as far as level 42 is concerned, obviously they're on the current tour at the moment. Um, I said I'm going to Southend tomorrow night. Um, I have heard already Mark actually say that November the 4th will be very um, emotional, he said, in one of the gigs so far. So what that's meaning, I don't know. I am aware that they have agreed to do a, a festival in Germany at some point next year. Um, so again, although he's not mentioning touring again, he, they're obviously going to carry on on the festivals. And this tour goes off to uh, Holland um, and ends up in um, Copenhagen, Gutenberg and Oslo. Now Oslo is very interesting. I would love, love to go and see that because my mum's actually Norwegian uh, and she actually comes from Oslo. So that would be double bubble for me if we went back there. To, I have been to uh, where she lived uh, when I was about seven, but... Um, so just going through um, on the posters and that, um, so I remember this one I got signed in Chatham at the end of 1981. Uh, Mark's put nice girlfriend and I do actually re remember her. Um, obviously she's not my wife, but she was a girlfriend at the time. Um, this one stays, stay cool son from Mark. Um, Phil's put thanks for being the number one fan. Yeah, debatable. <laughs> Um, this one Mark's put, are you coming to my wedding? Well, I never got the invite, uh, but obviously all of these have Boone on it. This one's extremely un uh, rare, I would say. I've got John Gould, sorry, Joy Gould's uh, signature on here, which is Boone and Phil's mum. Unfortunately, she is uh, not with us anymore. Um, this one celebrated my 60th gig at Cliffs Pavilion. Oh, I can't remember how many years ago. Um, but as well as the current band, I managed to get Phil to sign it, John Gould there. And if I'd managed to get Boone, that would have been absolutely amazing to have the original band and the current band. And this one was from uh, Reading. I can't remember what year it is, 83, I think. Um, and that's all I've put up uh, in, the, in here now. Um, as I said, I will be going to the gig. Um, I'll be wearing this T-shirt, which uh, my good friend Francis Levy got for me. Uh, it's Mark uh, with Gary Barnacle just saying, uh, <laughs> hey Mark, is that Julian Hall over there? So if you want to come up, if you're going to the Cliffs Pavilion gig, want to say hi, just look out for the t-shirt. I'll be happy to talk to you. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. Goodbye.